Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches, so your discretion is advised. We kill shit here. Cable restraint still standing here. I, I'm assuming the other one's still standing, hopefully. But we did get a catch, a good catch this time. I'll show you. Don't mind the wind, it's windy. It's windy as hell. Look at this. Waiting for us. Got to look like we got him in two traps. Now he is completely destroyed we got a bridger holding looks like look at we got him double foot wasn't going anywhere no digging um remember we put in this cat set because we remember we had coyote tracks on the trail here going in the driveway and then we had that cat crossing over right here so we went ahead and put in the set there we missed the cat the first day Nothing the second day, second day and the third day, we got a coyote. Then we had that cat over there. And so far, I don't see anything up on the hill, but I'll get a, I'll go walk up there and get a closer look, make sure the trap's still good. I'll get this guy taken care of and we'll, we'll show you. Stay tuned. Nothing in that. Take a walk down here and see. We got any new tracks? Maybe I'm. Maybe they're moved over this way somewhere. Being in the 40s, it's kind of chilly. It's a hell of a wind. Looks like I already walked over here. I didn't think I went this far. I did walk over here, yeah. Okay, so I'm catching the raccoons right down there, I see, and there's a hell of a den tree here. Check this tree out. The old Julie trap got a coon, a muddy, big old mud ball. Well, looks like that's all we got, a coon and a coyote. We'll go remake that set and move on. You guys can see our our moisture is starting to encroach into the dry dirt. We're still good for tonight. Tomorrow I'm probably gonna have to redo that. <sighs> Nothing yet. I don't see any fresh sign that anything has went by, so we're just waiting for them to come back through. And the snow is uh, soft, so 
they should leave tracks tonight for sure but hey we can't complain about that check out this shit Look at that piece of shit rock. That's pretty cool. Huh. I'll have to get, see if I can get permission to get some of that. So another piece right there. I'm always looking at for stuff like that. And I don't know what the hell's going on here. What is this? Some kind of petrified rock? Plastic rock? Plastic tree? Not sure. That's weird. Huh. I am a rock connoisseur. <laughs> That'd look good around the pond. Huh. Always looking for rocks. Alright, let's go get that coyote out. Get that remade and move on. Okay, so he's got her pretty tore up. Good buddy, you gone? Look at that double pad. Double pad catch right there. I mean, can't get any better than that. For holding power. It's a smaller dog, but it's got some good fur on it still. female okay so this is gonna be interesting I should add something to kneel down on because it is muddy here's my bed my whole bed anyways okay so there's a piece of scat right there pick that up there's some more scat there we want to keep that separate Okay, so we're moving into this territory here. Get all this snow out of here. And get all this much snow out of here as we can because it'll melt and then we got problems again. driving by okay put our bed in here there's back to my dry dirt there it's uh definitely dropped down now I'm gonna go a little extra on that. We don't want to redo it anytime soon. That's gonna be my bed right there. You don't worry about blood or anything. Pretty sure I turned it just like that the other day and I'm like I want to try it like that and then boom we got a double foot he's in there pouncing on it or something okay that's solid some more dirt Looks like mostly the pebbles rose to the top. Probably from going 90 down the interstate. The 
the old latex pan cover. Cross that. I don't want nothing getting down in there. Blend the whole dang thing. Some owl predator in there. One's skunky and one's not. I've kind of refined it a little bit. Both have been catching. I'm just gonna. The other one's just gonna be from now on. It's gonna have a little bit of skunk in it, and then some catnap. Just a little up here a little bit it'll run down in that hole we're trying for bobcats but this one has no flagging so we can get coyotes too since the coyotes are running right here we didn't want to scare the coyotes so that's why we are doing it like this here we go it's got all kinds of appeal now there's some turds over here we just move those back over whoops the old turd launcher 3000 put a turd here and we'll put one right over there somewhere wherever it lands there we go and we're ready to roll out of here nothing in the other sets don't see any new bobcat tracks or nothing so we are uh, ready for when they come back through. Well, we got like four or five raccoons now and a bobcat in three days. And we don't even have that many sets out. Like I only got a few cable strains right here. I didn't see any good sign that all the way down that way. So um, I want to go, I want to go down there and build or <laughs> I want to go build some 220 boxes and put a few out here and there, like anywhere there's a raccoon trail, clean them up. Maybe put one down here where the bobcats have been going, maybe catch one in a Connie box because we're in Iowa and you can use 220s on land. Just sporadically put a few 220s while we're uh, here and we might as well go hard until the end. So I'm having fun in Iowa. Um, Pretty soon it'll be beaver trap and it goes until the 15th of, of April, so we're gonna hit it hard still. Stay tuned, guys.